shit. Let's go. Hey, what's up guys, it's your boy Nick, Paradise Jones, we're back with another video. And on today's video, I'm gonna be sharing with you guys how I clean up my facial hair. Now I know I don't have much, but what I do have, I like to keep it clean. And as you can see, this quarantine got your boy looking a little rough. So I'm gonna be sharing with you guys some tips on how I shape up my mustache and also trim down my chin hair. Now I don't wanna keep you guys too long, so if you're new to my channel, go ahead and like this video and go ahead and hit that subscribe button too as well. And without further ado, let's go ahead and get into the video. All right guys, these are the tools that I'm gonna be using for today's tutorial. We have my wall detailers. I'm gonna be using these to take down the hair on my neck and also line up my mustache and my chin hair. My wall magic clips, I'm going to be using these to knock down the hair of my face to make sure it's all even. And here are the guards that I'm going to be using with them today. Now we have my comb. As for my razor, I'm going to be using this on my mustache. As you'll see in the video, my neck is pretty sensitive. So we're just going to use this to make sure my mustache is as sharp as possible. My shears to cut down any loose hairs. And then finally we have some aftershave that I'll use to clean myself up with afterwards. Alright guys, I like to start with a clean canvas. I like to be able to see what I'm doing. So first off, I'm going to start by shaving down all this hair that's on my neck. Now I don't like to jump around a lot, so I'm making sure to get every hair that I see so I don't have to come back and worry about it later when I'm finished. Now one thing you want to keep in mind while you're doing this is that you always want to stretch out your skin. By stretching out your skin, it allows you to get a closer shave and then also it prevents the clippers from snagging onto your loose skin. So I'll say this is probably about a month of growth right here. Normally I like to shave everything down probably about every two weeks, but due to this quarantine and staying at home and everything, it's been really no point. So I've been letting it grow out a little bit, but definitely time to do something about it. My neck was itching like crazy. Like I said, you want to make sure this is clean as possible and you don't want to be here forever. So why not just get in on the first pass? So when I'm doing my mustache, I like to use a one and a half guard. I feel it leaves my mustache looking full, but not too bushy. And it allows my lines to look extra sharp when I hit them with my detailers. Like I said earlier, I don't like to hop around, so I'm gonna start by lining up my mustache. First, I'm gonna start by hitting the bottom line, and then I'm gonna come back and hit the top after I make sure everything's straight. The mirror never lies. If it's straight in the mirror, it's gonna be straight when someone looks at you, so always remember to use your mirror. Me personally, I think the mustache is the hardest part. I don't know how many times I've cut one side shorter than the other, or I've cut my mustache too thin. So you definitely want to take your time at this part because you do not want to be walking around with half a mustache. Now my mustache doesn't take up too much of my top lip, so I'm not really trying to thin it out. I'm just trying to catch any stray hairs and trying to get that line as straight as possible on top. taking my time to make sure everything is natural as possible. All right, now for my chin hair, we're gonna be using a number three to knock it down. I like to leave it looking thick, but not too bushy. So I think about a three or two might be what I need. You can always take more hair off, but you can't put hair back on. So now that that's looking good, I'm gonna start by using my detailers to line the bottom first. I'm gonna make a straight line across, and then I'm gonna curve the edges a little bit. using my mirror to make sure everything is straight. Now 
So now I'm gonna round off my edges. I like more of a half oval look, keeping in mind to keep it as natural as possible. going to be applying some water I don't have any shaving gel on me right now and I'm going to be using my razor to clean up the top line of my mustache like I said in the beginning of the video my neck is sensitive as you can see it's already a little red so I'm just gonna use the razor to clean up my mustache stretching out my skin to make sure I don't cut myself now for my shears, I'm going to be using these to clean up any little flyaway hairs that I see just to give it that finishing touch. Now for everybody's favorite part. All right, that's the finished look. It's not too bad if I have to say so myself. All right, guys, that's the video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Now, like I said in the beginning of the video, if you're new to my channel, go ahead and hit that like button and go ahead and subscribe too as well. And be on the lookout for more weekly content. But until next time, I'm going to catch you guys later. Peace.